the best place to shop in Miami, according to me. Baja Shops. This is my favorite shopping location. I just love the vibe. I love how beautiful the scenery is. I am obsessed with it. So that's what we'll be doing today. I'm gonna go to a few stores. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time here because I have some events to attend, but here's my look. This dodo bar, dodo bar or hats, Gucci sunglasses. Uh, I think these are H&M earrings, I'm not sure. H&M satin sets with my Gordon One starfish. Maybe I can get a better video or outfit picture sometime today, but I think I did pretty good. Like I had this suit for so long and finally, the hat too. Had this hat and the suit for so long that I finally get to put it to use with these shoes. So I don't know. I know a lot of people like, especially with, with social media, you feel like, oh, I have to post so quickly. It's kind of, I don't know how they do it, honestly, y'all. Like just basically posting the outfit like you get the shoes you got the outfit already and I get it but sometimes it takes a while to complete an outfit and it just takes some time but I like how this came together so let's go wow I'm waiting I have about 10 minutes before the stores open up I'll just show you some of the stores that they have. They have this Pinko store. They have some really cute stuff, y'all. I feel like, yeah, we talk about New York and so many other places for shopping. Put my hat back down. But I feel like Miami is really the shopping mecca for me. And a girl has got to get it together in the, in the weight section because I need to be able to fit into these clothes. Mm-hmm, I do. This is, you know, I understand body positivity and all that stuff, but your girl wants to be able to wear the cute shit, okay? I don't want the fat version of it. I want to be able to wear it. So, I'm going to get it together. I'm getting my life together. At least 10, 15 pounds has to come off so I can get into some of this cute shit, okay? But, look at this store. How cute. How cute is that? Mm-hmm. So cute. And a lot of stuff is party for parties. How cute. I'm so sure that stuff. Dress. I love these dresses. They, they have a chokehold on me. Fur dresses. These little feather dresses. This is uh, probably my actual, how I like to show up everywhere. Like anywhere I go, I love to show up like this. Little bezels. This is about area. It's a matching set. This is cute. I like this. Mmm, Valentino. These are the Tango in Swarovski. I love this version. I have the orange version. Let's see. I love this pink patent, but this heel is much higher than I thought it would be in person. Yeah, we're going to X that out. I love this boot. I considered this boot ordering it, but I don't know. It's oddly shaped on the platform. I don't know if I would like it. Now, these girls are absolutely stunning. These are classic. I love these Dior sling bags with the Swarovski. The original versions were very cute, but these are actually given holiday. They are given Christmas party, New Year's Eve. I really love these and you can dress them down with like just good denim. All right, let's go to the product table. They have the Prada loafers in the heel version and the flat. I love them both. I have the flat version, one of my favorite classics. All 
All right, the official party girl has entered the room. Renee Calvilla. I absolutely love Renee Calvilla shoes. They are the ultimate party shoe. I actually prefer the platform versions. And I do actually like the boots. Okay, let's head on over to the Bottega table. They have the Bottega sandals. I am not a fan. Just don't like the silhouette. Um, but I do like this knee boot. I like the material, it's like a fur, but these are very classic looking, like they're a statement piece. I just don't think they're wide calf friendly, um, but they are cute. And I actually really like the platform. I've been looking at these online. I don't like the retail. They retail for about 1700 or 18, if I'm not mistaken, but yeah, I'm not a fan of the price. Okay, so now we're going to take a look at these Aqua Zoros. These are just amazing. There's something about looking at all the shoes together in these candy colors it makes you want to have like every single one. They are reminding me of just like a bunch of Skittles, cotton candy. I love them. They're so cute. I really do. These are on sale actually at online retailers for about 300 They retail for about $800. Um, but yeah, I think the yellow satin is my favorite but of course with satin you're gonna have more trouble in debris so think about that a little saline action went to another one of our favorite party girls miss amina mulati has entered the chat i actually really like this all crystal pink fuchsia beige sling bag i love the silhouette of this heel i'm not really a fan of pointy toes but these are cute i love the green and the pink again having them all together just makes you want each pair these are so cute gion Benito rossi these are the sexiest shoe of 2022 the sexiest i actually prefer the black version i like the dominatrix look of them they appeal they're super badass this is just a little bit too big though see the back it's just not mm -mm, it's too big Oh my gosh, these are a good vibe. Like these are a vibe. Suede, leather, white, and black monogram. Absolutely a vibe. They are cute. They come in different colorways too. Ah yes, gym tone. I love this blue satin sapphire. It is really a vibe. So it looks like Chanel is really on there purple gem tone vibe really vibrant colorways this tweed number is kind of cute but oh i think i see something now this is a little back that packs a big punch i just don't like the silver hardware or anything Thank you. Hello. Yes, I think I'm happy you find anything, okay? Okay, I will. Thank you. More gem tones. I really like the green. Oh my gosh, I am just drawn to anything bedazzled. This has my name written all over it. This one is kind of cute. I like the handles. I don't know. I like the shape as well, but something about the flap looks kind of plain. I like the quilted. I like the leather. I love the cover. So I'll probably go to this, go through this one really quickly because the essay 
um, has informed me, which they normally do, that there is no recording in Gucci Boutique stores, so we'll be on the low, so I'm not going to talk as much, so we'll see. Five dollars just to see it? Thank you. These two. Let me see. Ooh, nice. Which one do you like? Both. Which one? Gorgeous. Limited edition. How much are those? Forty-two hundred. Both of them the same yeah. retail? I have the shoes. I need that. Huh? I said I have the sneakers for that. I need that bag. Oh wow! You do the, the sprinters? Yeah. The one that come with pink? The platforms. The brown and the tan. Monogram platforms. Sneakers. Right there. Oh, okay. But the yes, brown yes, one. Yeah. Yes. Well, we have the same bag with other crystals. But these, like mine, has this tan here and then this. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I like this classic, but I like these. The fire. Yeah. Wow. Tiny dogs. Oh, yeah, I don't know. It's not my style. Even with the thick strap? No, with the thick strap, it changes things. But. I don't know if I'm liking this new. The blondie is cute. Yeah. Or oh, what about the mini? Look, the mini Diana. Mm-hmm. No, I like that one with the bamboo. The That's a surprise. It's a small one. Yeah, I do like that one. One here? No, because I'm not gonna get that one. I don't like the. You like the style? I'm not a bag collector. You know what? We have collector. We have the camera bag. We can take our lunch. That's six seventeen hundred. Yeah, it goes with it too. Why does this keep falling down? Yeah. Yeah, but it's Let me tell you. <laughs> yeah.